What is good, Diamond Dynasty, baby? Welcome back to another mother freaking video. There's a lot of girls with me right now. There's a lot of girls with me right now. There's a lot, got a lot of drugs with me right now, right now. But I'd rather just get high off you. Cause it doesn't feel the same, yeah, yeah. And a lot of girls say they might now, might now. I would never trust them in right now, right now. I would rather pass that blood to you like we used to do. And today, baby, y'all already know what the fuck going on in this goddamn video. Today, you guys wanted me to do a reaction video to Miss Dominique where motherfucking Wilson waste his time, okay? So I don't know whose time she's trying to waste, but she's about to waste a nigga time, okay? I guess this is dedicated to all the ladies. Dedicated to a fuck nigga, ladies enjoy. So it's dedicated to the ladies and the fuck niggas, you know what I'm saying? So I am assuming that Damo is tired of getting her time wasted. So she specifically made a song called Waste His Time. We're gonna go ahead and get right into it, man. Make sure if you have not already, click on the link in my description down below. Go subscribe to my spiritual channel, y'all. Make sure if you have not already, go cop your Diamond Life, Diamond Dynasty, baby. Merch, I appreciate everybody who has already copped and everybody who is about to cop right now. I really do appreciate you guys from the bottom of my heart, not the bottom of my balls, because I ain't got no goddamn balls. Let's go ahead and get into the post notification shout outs of the day, which is going to go to Kia Smith. I don't know if it's Indian baby or Indane baby. If I fucked it up, I am sorry. And Melissa Marino, thank you guys so much for having your post notifications turned on and for leaving me love in the comment section down below. I really do appreciate it, guys. We're gonna go ahead and get into this video. If you have not already, make sure that you join the Dynasty, baby. Subscribe to my YouTube channel, like this video, comment your thoughts and opinions down below. Share this video with a friend, hit that bell so you can be notified every time I post another lit ass video. Make sure that you DM me at the real Diamond M. And let me know what I should be reacting to next. And tell a friend to tell a friend to say they ain't your mama, tell they Uncle Joe. That nigga's still a hoe. Let's get right into this motherfucking video, y'all. Let's see how spicy this is. I'm gonna watch the preview all the way through, and then I'm gonna watch the full video, which I, not the full video, but the full lyric video, which I might pause, because y'all know I'm a pausing ass nigga, and I'm a talking ass nigga. So, so let's get into it, man. <laughs> All right, so I don't know if y'all remember, but when her and Lou had just split, a lot of people were saying that Lou What It Do is the inspiration behind this song too, okay? So <laughs> word was that she made this song or she dedicated this song, her inspiration for this song was Lou What It Do. Y'all hashtag Lou What It Do in the comment section down below. I don't know if that's true or not, but I do remember when she did a snippet of this song before. So yeah, people were saying that Lou What It Do's homie was trying to get at Damo. So I don't know. We're gonna go ahead and watch the lyric video now, y'all. So let's go ahead and get into the lyric video. Let me turn on the screen recording. So Waste His Time by Dominique Wilson dedicated to a fuck nigga. Ladies enjoy, but I think the inspiration behind a lot of her songs was Lou What It Do because that was the only nigga that she really fucked with in her adult life. You know what I'm saying? I feel like for this type of song, it should be, like she said, for a fuck nigga. Not just any nigga. Because there's a lot of good niggas still out here. It's a lot of good females still out here. 
you know? So don't let this confuse y'all, all right? All y'all who saying, real ass bitch give a fuck about a nigga and y'all lonely today, is probably because you're listening to these type of songs and really taking them literally. These are songs for a reason, they're just songs, guys. Don't let these songs be the reason why you single and alone, okay? Because the holidays is approaching today. I'm just saying, okay? So let me go back to this. I don't know if y'all remember, but she also pointed out the fact that Lou What It Do didn't pull out his wallet to pay for anything. Now, mind you, I don't know if she just offered to pay for everything or how that went, but she basically said that Lou What It Do did not want to spend a dime on a date, on dinner, on nothing. So she says at the last little line here, make him pay for all my meals and don't offer to pay a dime, I ain't lying. Look what it do, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, every now and then you gotta treat your girl, don't cheat your girl. But at the end of the day, from what they say, they were just friends. You know, I don't know Lou What It Do's perspective on it, but I do know that, hey, Damo said what she said. And she said that Lou What It Do did not pay for a dime, did not offer to pay for a dime. You know what I'm saying? Meals and shit like that. So, hey, it is what it is. I don't judge nobody, but hey, you know what I'm saying? We peep it, okay? <laughs> This is what I'm talking about right here. I'm that bitch little nigga, I'm the realest, you been hurting me for months, so nigga, yeah, you gon' feel it. Look what it do was hurting her for months. And then she proceeds to say, your homie wanna fuck with me, but he broke. He another you, so fuck him and his feelings. I'm gonna say this, I don't see Damo to be one of those girls who just likes niggas because of what they have or because of the money that they have or whatever it is, you know? It seems like Damo likes who she likes because of the person that they are or, you know, because she sees more than the money and the, like, the fake shit. I feel like she was just in her feelings while making this song because I don't think that she's the type to just fuck with a nigga for his money or for his lifestyle or whatever the case may be. If that was the case, she probably never would have fucked with Lil What It Do. And I'm not saying the nigga's doing bad, I'm just saying that he's not no, you know, Leonardo, he's not no Leonardo DiCaprio or no Chris Brown ass nigga or, you know what I'm saying, nothing like that. But anyway, she was attracted to him for who he was, you know. But anyway, let's continue. So basically she's saying she gonna be a fuck nigga to the fuck nigga. Okay. I'ma suck all on your bleep and I'ma do it for fun and then I'ma hit up other bleep while I stroke on his gun. I'm a wasted, I'm a wasted, all right, nigga. I'm a fucking play you for the way to fall. Yeah. Where's this 
I'm going to just say this, all right? Uh, if you heard of cancer, mm, it's not a good deal, bruh. Mm, any sign, but I'm just saying because I specifically know about cancers and they can be very vindictive when you hurt them. And they could try to hurt you 10 times worse because you hurt them. And if you ever try to come back, just know you're going to have to jump through some hoops, okay? And I ain't talking hula, all right? <laughs> Dama was definitely in her feelings. That's a fact. Shots the fuck fired, y'all. Like, no cap. Y'all cannot tell me that she was not shooting at a nigga, okay? <laughs> you cannot tell me that she was not shooting at a nigga. Damo came, okay? She saw and she conquered, all right? She said she is not having none of this shit from these niggas, bruh. And I ain't mad at her. I feel you, you know what I'm saying? Especially when you go through a heartbreak of some kind and the nigga act like you ain't shit and just toss you to the side and yada, 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 you know? And now you feel like, yeah, nigga, I'm finna waste your time just like you wasted mine type of thing, you know? So, shout out to my nigga Lou, what it do, you know? I can almost bet money on him being the reason why this song was made or the inspiration behind the song, yo. Leave me a comment down below and let me know if y'all agree or disagree. Let me know if y'all are fucking with the song or not. I definitely like the other song that she just released with the music video dedicated to Lou too, Lou What It Do. I like that one a lot better. I was feeling those vibes. This one is more of a, you know, motherfucking real ass bitch give a fuck about a nigga song, you know? So I know all the bitches gonna love this shit, you know? But anyway, guys, y'all leave me a comment down below. Let me know exactly how you guys feel. I appreciate all of you guys. Like I said, man, I think right now we're at 201,000 Diamond Dynasty Baby family members. I really do appreciate you guys, each and every one of y'all, man. Sometimes I don't be feeling like recording. I definitely didn't feel like recording today, but y'all have been blowing me up to do this reaction video, man. And I gotta come through with the come through, you know what I'm saying? Sometimes you just gotta do what you gotta do and come through. But I love you guys so much from the bottom of my heart. Not the bottom of my balls because I ain't got no goddamn balls. I just woke up at around 3 something, 3.45 ish p.m. And I went to bed around like 8, no, 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 9 something a.m. So I'm still kind of tired. I'm, I haven't ate all day. Well, I've only been up for like a couple of hours, but I haven't ate all day. I'm going to go ahead and go get something to eat after I edit and post this video. But I love you guys so much, man. Make sure if you have not already joined the Dynasty, baby, subscribe to my YouTube channel, like this video, comment your thoughts and opinions down below, share this video with a friend, hit that bell so you can be notified every time I post another lit ass video, make sure that you DM me at the real Diamond M. And let me know what I should be reacting to next. And tell a friend, tell a friend, tell that ain't your mom, tell that Uncle Joe, he's still a hoe. I will see you guys in the next motherfucking video. Love y'all, man. Peace. We out. Yeah, I'm trying to fuck with you.